Tonight at 10, just a few hours from now, five members of the Hazel Green Volunteer Fire Department will drive down to Lee County. They're going there to help people affected by last weekend's deadly tornadoes. Thanks for watching tonight at 10. I'm Greg Privet. Way 31 Sarah Singletary is live now after talking with the firefighters prepping for tomorrow's delivery of heartfelt help. Sarah. Greg, that's right. At 4 a.m., just six hours from now, this crew from the Hazel Green Volunteer Fire Department will be driving down this trailer right here behind me. Kind of hard to see, but it's full of bottled water, hygiene products, baby formula, and all of that is going straight to Lee County, specifically the Smith Station area. And after talking with these guys today, I've learned they're looking to give out way more than just the tangibles. That's the hope, is just to bring them hope. Danielle Watson is part of the group taking boxes of supplies down to Lee County Monday morning. But for her, this trip is about more than the material. My hope is to meet some of the families that were affected and talk with them one on one, just on a personal level. She's eager to step into those conversations because she's no stranger to tragedy. When the bad things happen, we are the ones that show up. Nathan Gleghorn's also a part of the group. He's prepared to see things he's never seen before. And even in the face of that uncertainty, he's ready to do whatever he can. That's what I went in this field for, was to help. And I think it would be um, a good thing for them because I need all the help they can get. Gleghorn said he's willing to do there what he's used to doing here, hard work. Moving trees, uh, clearing things out, getting, getting the county back to how it was. Because lending a helping hand is who these guys are. It's what we do. Now this crew is only going down for the day tomorrow, so any additional donations that are sent in over the next few days will be sent down to Lee County with other groups leaving from our area. Reporting live in Hazel Green, Sarah Singletary, Way 31 News.